Hi, my name is Tanya and I love to travel. During these uncertain times of COVID-19, exploring safely has been tricky. I've found road trips to be the safest way to explore while still being safe. Over the holidays, I was lucky enough to have a friend, Namiko, who was, like me, unable to travel to her family and was up for an epic road trip. Join us as we cruise from my home in New York City down the eastern coast and back up through the Appalachian Mountains. In this week's video, we drive into the city of Asheville for a COVID safe spa day and a culinary and aesthetic tour of this hip artsy city in the middle of North Carolina. One of the main draws for us to come to Asheville, North Carolina was this outdoor Japanese inspired spa. They have these individual little cabins that are very airy that have a salt water uh, hot tub and you can book an hour, you can book an hour and a half and you can book a spa side tea service which is what we did. And after all the hiking and being in the car so much, it's exactly what we need. <music> My friend Namiko has a lot of experience with natural hot springs in Japan so she was really excited about this and this isn't really the same because these hot springs aren't natural but they do have nanten, these little plants that are actually something you would find in Japan and so that's a nice touch. Being in that hot water for so long it feels so warm and cozy to be in like dry clothes and I feel like my body's going to be hot for a while afterwards. <laughs> So after all that relaxing and soaking in the hot tub, we are pretty hungry. So we came to sort of the Riverfront Arts District of Asheville to pick up what I'm told is Obama's favorite barbecue at a place called 12 Bones Barbecue. We got pork ribs, which seems to be the popular thing on the menu, and I am excited. So now we're ready to eat Obama's favorite barbecue, unconfirmed by me, but I believe it. I got the naked, naked ribs, and she got the brown, brown sugar. sugar. Let's see how it t how do it taste. Do you want one of the next? No, ones? I just I'm impressed that you took it apart by hand. Oh my god! It's good. Yeah, it's really good. It? Like you only have it's bread. Not, no, it has like salt and pepper. I think. Mm. Mm, it definitely has more than the salt and pepper. Mm. 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 It tastes smoked, so it has that smoked flavor. I'm not a big fan of pork ribs, but these ones are really good. Then I got jalapeno cheese grits, which sounds amazing. It's delicious. Oh my god. Mm. It is yummy. And we also got pickled okra, which I think will go perfect with the barbecue. Oops. I'm gonna not get your car dirty, I promise. It's so dirty over. Oh my god. 
It's really good. Oh my gosh, it's really good. And it's good. It was really good. I do recommend this place if you're ever in Asheville. So that barbecue gave us some energy and it's not raining right now so we came to downtown Asheville to walk around and check out. They have a bunch of different sculptures and I'm really loving the vibe of this town. It's very hipstery and it's a much more bustling city than I expected. We're getting all four, we're gonna taste them all. Yum! So we're starting with the vanilla glaze. So we're starting already. You can start. Mm. These donuts are fried fresh when you order and they taste very fresh. They're very light and crispy, really crispy on the outside, which is delicious. This is the eggnog brandy. Mm. I like eggnog a lot and the brandy flavor is not too strong, which is good. Cinnamon sugar, which is exactly what you think it would be. I like the glazed ones better. Sesame almond. Toasted almond sesame. Toasted almond sesame. Oh my god. That is the most rich one. Very good. That one has the most strong flavors, but it's very rich and delicious. My favorite is the eggnog brandy. It's light, has flavor, but not too strong. So good. Good choice, Namiko. She found it. Good, good job. So on our way out of Asheville, we're driving on the Blue Ridge Parkway, which Namiko is super excited about because it's so beautiful and scenic and they have overlooks like this where you can see the Blue Ridge Mountains. They're blue because of something called isoprene in the atmosphere, which is produced by trees like eucalyptus and oak and poplar. And in the air, the light hits it and it reflects blue. And that's why these mountains look so blue. enjoyed this Asheville video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. I have a lot more socially distant content to come. So if you want to see more, please hit subscribe and click the bell to be notified when new videos are available. Until next time, bye!